For the next few minutes, we will show you how to manage current users who are signed into Sage 300. The current user screen displays information about users currently signed into Sage 300 using a LAMP pack or integration access pack license. It also displays information about users who are signed in without using a license such as time card users. When viewing users signed in using a LAMP pack license, you choose whether to see users who are signed into the classic desktop or the web screens. On the LAMP pack tab of the current user screen, the administrator user can forcefully sign out users who are signed in using a LAMP pack license, including users signed into web screens. The ability to forcefully sign out users is limited in the following ways. Only the administrator user can forcibly sign out other users. Only users who are signed in using a LAMP pack license can be forcibly signed out. Other types of users such as users signed in using an IAP license cannot be forcibly signed out. Before evicting a user, it is recommended that you try to contact users to ask them to sign out. Let's see how to manage users in Sage 300. First, log into Sage 300 Desktop as the administrator. We can see that user John is signed into the web screens. From the Sage 300 Desktop Help menu, select Current Users. The Current Users screen appears. This screen displays information about users currently signed into Sage 300 using a LAMP pack or Integration Access Pack license. It also displays information about users who are signed in without using a license, such as time card users. When viewing users signed in using a LAMP pack license, you choose whether to see users who are signed in to the Classic Desktop or to the web screens. We can see that for the Classic Desktop, the username listed is the administrator. If you select the Show Screens Users Have Open option, Information is displayed about screens each user has open, including the company in which each screen is open and when each screen was opened. It also displays the name, ID, and contact information for each user. For each type of license, LAMP pack and IAP, it displays the maximum number of users who can sign into Sage 300 concurrently and the current number of users signed into Sage 300. To forcefully sign out a user from the web screens, select the web screens. You will now see a list of all the users signed into the web screens. Let's select John Smith, then click Sign Out Selected Users. The Sign Out User screen appears. A caution message appears stating that forcefully signing out users may cause serious problems, including data corruption. Before proceeding, consider backing up your data. In the Enter Administrator Password field, enter your password and then click Sign Out Users. When the users are signed out, the current user screen is updated automatically. From the web screens, the user John will now see a session ended warning. After forcefully signing out a user, it is recommended that you follow up with the user that you signed out to inform them that you signed them out. Congratulations! You now know how to manage current users who are signed into Sage 300.